continuation of the celebration of the International Day of Peace, women and peace stakeholders in Kaduna have called for a sustainable conflict resolution mechanism to end communal, ethnic and religious intolerance. They made the call at a peace work organized by the Kaduna, Kaduna Peace Commission and the Women for Peace Mediators Network aimed to raise awareness among residents on the need for peaceful coexistence, regardless of tribe or religion. The Vice Chairman of Kaduna Peace Commission, Dr. Saleh Momale, emphasized the importance of embracing cultural diversity. He highlighted that women and children are the most affected by conflicts, urging for diverse approaches to foster peaceful communities across the nation. The culture of peace is a major, major responsibility for women. And therefore, it's not surprising that the women are dominant in coming out to appeal to the people of Kaduna State, to their coast mothers and our sisters, to work very hard to cultivate a culture of peace. Chairperson of the Women for Peace Mediators Network, Professor Evelyn Yusuf, stressed that the symbolic march represents a collective commitment to promoting harmony and understanding nothing that peace, an understanding, noting that peace is a shared responsibility of humanity. There are tenets by which uh, people of given religions are expected to live, and these tenets help. Uh, the moment uh, people adhere to these uh, tenets, then there is order in society, and once there is order in society, then uh, there is peace in society. The economic situation now, both the Christian and Muslim are facing the same challenge, so it is a right time for people of faith to come together, to work together, to promote peace, so that Kaduna will be developed, uh, the younger ones will have opportunity to go to school, and there will be opportunity for people to even afford jobs. Peace is being celebrated all over the world. As mediators who work around peace building and peacemaking, our slogans are around cultivating the culture of peace. And that is what we are doing to raise awareness and sensitize the whole state and the nation at large that peace is sacrosanct with living and that the only way we can thrive is for us to live together in peace and harmony. That is the, 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 the work, the, the, the main reason why we are doing this work. The peace stakeholders called on religious leaders, peace building stakeholders and citizens to adopt alternative dispute resolution methods to mitigate conflicts and build lasting peace. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.